It is time to unleash number 16. What's going on, everybody? On Entertainment Gaming here presenting Dragon Ball Z Burst Limit. Here we go, guys. Another episode. This ought to be good. This is where 16 actually fought Cell. Uh, one of actually one of my many favorite fights because 16 actually put up a great fight. Here we go. Oh, look at this. Look at this. Look at this. The time has come to fight before I meet Goku. Uh-oh. Oh, shit. Oh! You don't have a chance, Cell! Oh, crap. Bam! Right in the kisser. Joke's on you, bitch. Look at that, the strength of 16. I really wonder who would have won if 16 were to fight Goku. Let me know in the comment section below, guys, on who would win between Goku and Android 16 because I, I personally would have loved that because Android 16 was personally designed to, like, legitly butcher Goku without a shadow of a doubt. So, I mean, it's just like... And, and he had a fucking... What is it? He had a nuclear warhead in his fucking chest. So, it's like... Uh-oh. There we go. It's actually pretty interesting to see Android 16 because when he first, you know, made his debut here, I was thinking, like, this guy's he's a giant. He's pretty much a giant, badass-looking android. And for him to say, listen, I was specifically designed to butcher and kill Goku here, I was thinking, like, oh, shit. Darn you! Why are you still talking about you fucking bitch? Anyways, oh crap, um, like, I, I, I don't know, if 16 could beat Cell, do you guys think he would have been able to beat Goku? Because, I mean, that that's just a very good question, because 16 and Goku would have been, like, that would have been an amazing fight. I personally would have loved to see Android 17 versus Goku, Android 18 versus Goku, Android fucking 16 versus Goku. I would have loved to see all the androids go up against Goku. Um, I hate, I really do hate how he had that virus. Um, I, I, I think it would have been awesome to see Goku and Vegeta and Trunks team up against all three of these androids, 16, 17, and 18. That would have made so much sense. And therefore, the, the fight in general could have been like a little tie until Cell showed up and pretty much fucked everybody over and absorbed the other two. So, it, it, to, to me, they, I mean, they could have gone uh, like in alternative directions and Cell's really fucking pissing me off right now. Come here, you punk ass bitch. Get punched. Oh, what a fucking, look at that, oh shit, I, he knows the comment how many fucking ha, so I can't really do much. Also guys, let me know in the comment section below on what your favorite android is. Is it, oh fuck, fuck! Is it android 16, is it android 13, 12, 11, 18, 19, 20, fucking A, like which, which one was it? I mean, to me, my favorite android is probably super android 13. But, you know, if, if we had to disinclude him, then it would probably be Android 16 or 20 because I, I really loved Dr. Giro's model. He was he actually looked pretty badass before he turned into a coward, so... Uh-oh. What? What? Uh-oh. Why are you here? Yeah. 18, I told you to run away. I caused serious damage to him, but it was not enough to kill him. You better get going. Seventeen, you must run away now. Now, not a chance. You idiot. You think I'm gonna turn and run? You've gotta be joking. You idiot. You damaged him. Now I'm gonna finish him off. Yeah, good Coming luck, buddy. Out. What? You really like? 17 didn't stand a fucking chance against Cell, like, not even in the least. I mean, he tried and whatnot, but, you know, I, I still think 18 should have gotten involved in that fight because 18 was just, like, she was watching. She wasn't really doing as much, you know, so it was like, what the fuck, man? 18 should have jumped in there, you know, just to defend her brother because if that was me and if I was an android and I saw my fellow android get beat up by, like, this mysterious creature... I, I I would definitely fucking help as these giant fucking dragon balls are bouncing. Ah, Tian! I might die here. Whoa! My ribs! How did he absorb them? Don't underestimate me. 
I, I, must, I must have skipped a chapter or something, but that, that's what it led me to, so. TN versus Semi Imperfect Cell, which would which which would be slaughter in and of itself. I mean, TN. I I think TN's the strongest human on the planet. It definitely isn't Yamcha, and it definitely isn't Krillin. Um, is it TN? I I have a feeling it might be. Uh oh. But do you know what I think they should have done? Pretty much, I I, I think that they should have introduced TN to the Elder Kai. Therefore, like, just pretty much, like, allowing them to, like, uh, like, awaken his true power, because I, I think Tien deserved it. Mega! Fucking Cell trying to intimidate me over there. Screw you, Cell! Oh, he's fucking strong, man. I remember when Tien kept doing those tri-beam attacks, holding him down. What would you do if, if you were Cell? Like, I, I, I know I, I, I'd i be pissed. If I was Cell, and I was in that little pit... And I had some fucking bald-headed human shoot like these attacks, keeping me away from my destination. I would be so pissed if I were to transform. I'm telling you that right now. If I was Cell and I achieved my perfect form, I would have literally just blown up the fucking Earth right then and there. I, I would have been like, you know what? Fuck Goku. Fuck Vegeta. Fuck all of them. You know, if they want to fight me, I'm gonna fight them whenever I want and how I want. And if they don't like it, I'm just gonna blow the planet up. This is why I love Kid Buu so much because every single villain always wanted to threat about oh i'm gonna destroy the planet but they never really you know went through with it and sells fucking me up i'll show you my real power shout out tian you ain't got no fucking real power anyways um like i said kid boo when he first made his debut he pretty much like went right into it like he fucking blew the planet up right in front of goku and vegeta he pretty much launched his attack at goku and vegeta fucking sell sell screw you sell Come on, come on. What the fuck, man? What am I doing that's wrong? This idiot sucks, man. Fucking TN. You're useless in the sky. Uh-oh. Man. Oh, look. He grew his arm back. Oh, no. Fuck you! Oh, whoa. Oh, his life went up. Shit! All right, I'm going to have to be very, very, very cautious on this one. I'm gonna have to keep doing the same moves then if I want to fucking advance. Cause th there is no way I'm gonna be able to fuck him up like with this and legit. Mega. Fucking TN. Can you imagine if Yancha was there too? Yancha would have been like, yeah, Wolf Fang Fist! And I would have just grabbed his little Wolf Fang Fist bullshit and I would have just beat the fucking god out of him. And be like, you, you wanna fight me, Yancha? You're not even worthy on. You're not even worthy of like doing anything on this planet. Just go away. Come on, come on, TN. Oh god, I'm fucking him up, but it ain't working. Come on. If he unleashes his ultimate attack, I am like beyond screwed. But then again, it looks like I'm winning. Oh shit, he's gonna go. Oh, that was such horse shit. Get the fuck out of here. I'm gonna beat the god out of him right now. That was such bullshit. It's because his fucking arm regenerated. That's why. And these Dragon Balls are bouncing all over the place as if they just took some bat salts or something. Look at him. Look at him, fucking all over the place. Ball, legitly the the phrase balls to the wall. Sorry, Chao Tzu. I'm. Ah! <laughs> fucking asshole. Screw you, man. I mean, I I I loved Imperfect Cell. I just thought he was too much of a bitch. Like Imperfect Cell to me, he was just like all whimpery. I must achieve my perfect form. If I don't achieve my perfect form, I'm gonna cry. Like. He was pretty much butthurt when, when fucking Vegeta beat the shit out of him. And he was pretty much butthurt when he saw that Trunks was way above him. And he was butthurt when he found out Piccolo was strong again. Like, he, Sal kept getting butthurt, like, in his second form. He was way more butthurt than he was in his fucking previous form. And that's why I love his semi-perfect form. Well, I don't know. I love his imperfect form more because uh, he pretty much, like, he, he, he was conniving. He was evil and whatnot. The semi-perfect, he was like, oh, I, I'm better than you because I got this, this, and this. Alright, quit powering up, you little prima donna. Come on, you're going to fight me a while. Right, right. Fucking, and now he's using Godon Rays. And, uh, I'm, I'm, I was about to use fucking Godon Rays, sorry. I'm getting all confused because he kicked my ass. Back here, back here. Oh, you were going to do what? You were going to do what? Where, you piece of shit? Ah, ah. Oh, crap, crap, crap. That was a big mistake. Surfer! Yeah. Bam! Oh, you got it now, nah, 
Watch, he's gonna use that little technique where he's gonna fucking grow his arm back out, and then I'm gonna be fucking pissed. Oh, see, I knew it. Pop goes the weasel. Look at that. Oh, Jesus. I'm probably gonna use another slower solar flare to fuck him up. Mega. Surfer! Look at that. And for the finale. What the fuck, man? That wasn't my attention. Mega! Okay. Hey, Mega! Okay, that, did that do any damage or no? I can't even fucking tell. Oh, you piece of shit. What the fuck am I doing? No, don't taunt in front of him, you idiot. Oh my god. He's worse than Yamcha. I better not fucking lose this, or I'm gonna be one pissed off fucking person. I'll be damned if I fucking lost to Cell. Especially his imperfect form. Are you kidding me right now? Mega! 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 I'm gonna keep doing these fucking elbows until I kick his ass. Oh, fuck. There is no way Tien would ever last in a fight like this with Cell. Are you kidding me right now? This, 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 is, this is just wrong. This is wrong in every single sense of the word that's wrong. Back here! Oh, did I get him? Back here! Uh, I hope I keep getting him right now. Back here. Keep doing that. Oh, fucking Cell. What a stupid ass. Yeah. My little blue aura. Back here. I wonder if Cell was ever aware of Bills. I mean, like... My final attack! Oh, here we go, here we go, here Fuck, one more, one more, one more! Come on, one more, one more, BAM! Oh, what the fuck?! Oh, he better not. Oh, he better fucking not, man. I'm gonna be so pissed if this guy's able to fucking kill me. What the fuck am I doing?! He's gonna fuck me up, I know- oh, There we go, finally! You big green tub of shit. Oh, here we go. Illuminati! Oh, you're screwed. Bam! Bam! I'm pretty sure he made louder noises than that. And I'm pretty sure Cell took it, like, way better than he did now. Look at that, he looks like he died. He did way more tri-beams than that. He cut a giant triangle in the earth. And then he faded. And he's out, ladies and gentlemen. I can't believe that pathetic TN gave me so much trouble. Aw. You mad? Cell? I mean, just Jesus Christ, so... Anyways, everybody, thank you all for watching this episode of Dragon Ball Z Burst Limit, everyone. My name is Underground Entertainment Gaming. If you guys are Dragon Ball Z fans, don't forget to subscribe to my channel for all the latest <laughs> Dragon Ball Z news information updates. Oh my goodness, I am Super Vegeta. Look at that right there. Uh -huh. For those of you out there that enjoyed the video, please give this video a like, rape that thumbs up button, leave a comment, help spread the video to support the series. Stay tuned for the next episode because I am Super Vegeta is going to kick it off, everyone. Thank you all for watching, as always, and I hope you all enjoyed. Peace!